Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm so excited because I have this Disney scar Halloween tutorial for y'all. And I love Disney, so I'm really excited for this one particularly. And I know I sound really weird right now, it's just because these things are so hard to speak in. Um, but I thought they looked really cool with this look, so I didn't want to take them off from my intro. I hope you guys think that they are cool also. Without further ado guys, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, turn on your notification bells so we can hop right in. Okay guys, so for my skin today, I'm using my Porefessionals and on my eyes, I'm just using my Urban Decay Potion Primer. You wanna make sure that you're prepping your skin really well for this because we're gonna be using a lot of dark shadows on our face. For my shadows today guys, I'm going to be using three from my Morphe 350 palette and I'm just doing a real cat eye today. So I'm starting off with my darkest color on my outer corner, bringing that down and in a little bit. The lightest one is going to go on my lid and then I'm just using a lighter, more orangey brown to blend those together and smoke out that darker color. You guys can do really whatever you want for your eyes. I just thought that a cat eye would be appropriate because, you know, Scar is a lion. I just did my liner off camera guys. I did a really dramatic wing and extended my inner corner but for my lower lash line and my waterline up top I am going to be putting in MAC coffee eyeliner. Now for my lower lash line I'm just going to be using a lighter brown to kind of smoke out that coffee that we used and I'm also going to be connecting that to the shadow that we have up top. For my brows, you guys, I'm just using my Benefit Pencil, but I'm going to really arch them up later, so this is just for a general shape. I'm going to be sketching out where I would like to put my mane and my beard now, guys. So you don't have to use a white liner for this. If you want to just kind of go for it, you can. But I just find it easier and more precise if I sketch it out first. And so now guys, I'm just taking an angled brush on that same dark shadow that we use on our eyes and I am trying to stay as sharp as I possibly can going over those lines. I'm going back and forth between my angled brush and my blending brush because I want this to fade out really nicely but still be very, very pigmented along those lines. I also want you guys to notice where I am concentrating the majority of that product, where they dip down, kind of where the points are. So just my temples, my forehead, on my cheeks. And when it comes to my kind of contouring, so you want to kind of create a straight line from your ear to your mouth and just ignore that it goes up and down. I hope you guys can see what I mean here. And to give that a nice gradual transition, guys, I'm just going in with a blending brush and that orangey brown shade that we use on our eyes to really smoke that out. When you guys are doing your nose, just be sure that you leave a little area blank for those nostrils and to really make that very triangular and kind of smoke it up.
I'm just creating the outline of my scar, but this is just a rough draft kind of. I'm going to go over it with some fake flesh in a little bit. So this will sharpen you up, girl. We're going to go in very, very carefully. I'm using my concealer brush and a much darker foundation than I would normally use because Scar is really just a darker character. And I'm going all the way around, bringing that up my nose and really being very careful when I'm around those corners. We want to make it nice and sharp, but not cover any of the hard work that we've done. Also guys, just ignore my chin over here because I ended up not liking it and I'm taking it off right now and I'm going to do something else. So my chin is off and with a much noticeably lighter foundation, I am going in and just putting that all around my chin and on my mouth over here because lions have that and I'm just redrawing my chin only this time I'm going to make it go down instead of up. For Scar's beard, I am really just using the same colors that I have been using for my whole face. Going in, bringing that down to my neck in kind of a triangle shape and blending it out with that orangey brown. For my lips, I am going to be doing my cartoon lip that I normally do with my extended top lip. And I'm using my Jeffree Star lipstick and I'm also using a combination of that and When in Doubt. I can do a tutorial on these lips if you guys want. They're really, really simple and easy and I just think they came out really cute. I'm just going to be creating a line from my nose all the way down to my lips and adding some contour and highlight. For my nose, I want to make it really dark and really wide, so I am going to be using eyeshadow for this instead of regular contour. Now moving on to our scar, I am just going to be using some of my Mayron Extra Flesh and adding that on to give it a little bit of dimension. I'm adding my whiskers using that same eyeliner pencil that I used for my waterline. I'm also going to be taking a really thin angled brush guys and just going over my whiskers to really make them smooth and flared out. Once that extra flesh has set guys, I'm going to be going in with my color work and for this I'm using a pink shadow and I'm also using a very, very, very light foundation. The last step guys is to make your eyebrows super arched. Scar has really triangular eyebrows. If you want to look at a picture of him for reference, it could really help you with your placement. Okay friends, I will be right back. Okay guys, so I threw on some contacts, I threw on some lashes and some teeth I am not going to lie to y'all, the teeth were kind of a real pain in the bottom to put on, that's first off. Second, you can only keep them on for 15 minutes. And three, I can't talk, clearly. So if you are going to recreate this look, the fangs look really cool, but maybe for pictures or videos, definitely not for like a party or speaking. <laughs> oh, and I have my little mouse. Because Scar eats a mouse in the, in the movie. He tries to, anyway. 
So I really hope that you guys loved this look. I was so excited to do it for you. And I am saying so many S's right now that I can't say. So I'm saying so many S's. So guys, <laughs> because I can't speak, I'm gonna end it here. Be sure that you give this video a big thumbs up for me if you haven't already. Subscribe to my channel because I do have more Halloween stuff coming out for you guys. Turn on those notification bells and I cannot wait to hang out with you guys next time. Bye!